What's going on guys, welcome back again to another Spanish video and today as you've seen from the title it's not at all misleading. Today I'll show you two rates that offered over 3 million resources in total. To be precise, 3 million and 66,000 resources. Okay, the first one is this one. Look at this, look at this. I found it. 911,000 gold, 730,000 elixir and 4,500 dark elixir. Add Barge, my usual attack strategy to farm both of my heroes which really helped because if you have heroes using bards it's really helpful sometimes to get into the base and get some storages maybe so as you can see gold mines are full um, almost like the storages are, are half full collectors are semi full and it's a farming base fumes from the clan DK Julian farm 2 whatever and he has imperial towers which fries my archers and barbarians but it's okay now a lot of the loot is also inside in the storages but there's a good a decent amount of it outside in the collectors which I managed to get okay so throw that lightning spell because I really like now that I can't uh, lightning spell storages I lightning spell full collectors because you make a profit I've um, researched it, like if uh, the lightning spell cost 30,000, I'm not sure, but yeah, 30,000, there it is, I drop another one at the um, Dark Elixir Drill, and um, if you lightning spell a full Elixir Collector, you get more than the cost of the lightning spell, so it's a profit, so why not do it? Archer Queen sniped at Town Hall, I'll activate his uh, hair ability, getting that Elixir Storage, let's speed it up, and boom, she's dead before she can destroy it completely and I go away with 733,000 resources in total, a decent amount of Dark Elixir 2, uh, 1800 and plus 10 trophies but who gives a shit about trophies. Now the second raid is from Sam, 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 let's visit his base, shout out to Sam and the next raid is going to be by him, look at this, he shared it, look at this like it's incredible like mine was a bit bigger but this one is pretty cool too like 611,000 gold 808,000 elixir and okay, an okay amount of dark elixir 1086 dark elixir now the collectors are inside the base but luckily Sam is smart and he will manage to get them even if they're on the inside um, a small tip guys, when you find collector bases with um, their collectors inside, don't throw all your bar charm at the same time, just like you do when they are outside, because everything is going to be killed by the mortars. Uh, uh, deploy them slowly, 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 let them take out the mortars and the wizard towers, because those are your biggest enemies when you are attacking a base with tier 1 troops, and yeah. And of course, if you have your heroes, it's going to be um, more easier. It's going to be easier. So yeah, he's dropping his heroes, getting on the inside, and now that there are no mortars targeting that area, he starts dropping his uh, barbarians. Very smart thinking of Sam. Good job, Sam. If you're watching this video, and yeah, it was a very good raid because he could have failed completely with this basis that had the collectors on the inside it's a bit tricky either you take the loot or not it's very easy to fail that's what I'm trying to say so he takes out the dark elixir a decent amount of loot is remaining 600,000 resources are left but he managed to go away with 700,000 resources in total he gets 43% uh, minus 31 trophies but who cares if you get 700,000 of one single raid okay both raids were, were with barge make sure to use barge if you want to farm your worlds like mine legos for the win and yeah hope you enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up for those crazy loot raids 3 million in 2 raids subscribe if you're not subscribed and see ya in the next video guys